Yes, Alex from Roadster Alex. Um, as you know, I post videos so now and then whenever I have time. So you're looking at this video because you want a shiny water bottle uh, in your MR2 Spider or any other car. So I ordered the two liter aluminium welded um, universal water bottle can, whatever you want to call it, is for the washer fluids. So don't mistake it with a catch can or for your, um, you know, your, your, your coolant or anything. It's just for um, the washer fluid. The one that it's in the MR2, I didn't like where it is. I didn't like how it looks. I didn't like anything about it. So I decided to buy another one and um, I'm not making an unboxing video, but I'm just quickly going over, you know, what it is, how it looks and what you have to do to modify it, because that's very important. So keep watching. So after looking uh, for some locations to mount it, uh, this was the location I came up with, simply because uh, there's one bolt here. I tried that one, uh, didn't work. That one's too tight and um, couldn't find anything, you know, that really fits in this case. I did want it here um, because I might use this for the battery, not sure yet. And on that side, I didn't feel like it either. So, and there's enough space under there to uh, get, you know, some silicon hoses and put them to the pump and everything. So that's the location I decided to uh, to use as test fit and then I'm going to modify the pump or um, the hole basically in the back um, and see how it goes so so basically um, this is the bottle as you can see has to you know to hang it up at the firewall like that so um, the thing is that there's a drain at the bottom I basically, there was a like a gasket thingy in there. I took it out um, because it didn't fit. This is about 11 mil and our pump, which I have over here, that's about 13 uh, mil from the outside. Then we have this gasket, which is the original one, which goes over here. Um, which you know is about seven is about 15 to 17 uh to, to about 20 mil so that doesn't work and uh, i was thinking if i make the hole bigger i had one of those for my catch cam so because it's a threaded i can basically put it under there make it like this you know just go straight down all the time um or even make it in the corner if I really have to. But um, then I ordered some hose, um, 30 mil, um, 50, uh, 50 centimeters, so I can connect those. So basically it will sit something like over this. Um, but I'm, I will show you, you know, with the installation, how it looks. I had to um, make it bigger. So I ordered some parts in to make the hole bigger so I can screw this in then put a washer on it. It already has some gaskets there, but I'm going to put another um, washer in between then that one and then a nut from the other side so I can actually screw it in, make it tight as possible and um, you know see if it works. So this should work, uh, but keep watching because I'm going to show you what I did and how it looks uh, as final product. So what I did, I bought some uh, quick steel, uh, which is basically paste that you, um, you know, paste and it will get like metal. And it was a tip from a friend, put it on, uh, you know, should be hard and cured in about an hour. Um, I was looking for a bolt, put two washers on it before. Um, just go to check and see if it does anything. We'll try it with water first, of course. Um, and if this works, then, you know, that's the solution for me. Um, just need to be sure, you know, everything is, you know, working correctly and, you know, it's strong. And, uh, but other than that, it's not too bad, as you can see. Um, it took me a while to get this in, at home. Um, so I will let you know how it goes. So what I decided to do is 
put the water bottle, bottle over there, pump it over there. I need to extend the wires from there to there. Um, so just cut the plug off, extend the wires. Only two wires anyway. Um, then, you know, I can make a bracket or something to, you know, keep it hanging, but see, it moves a bit, but you know, not too much. Um, might put a clamp on the, on the big red hose over there. Then might make a bracket from there to there. Um, so the it goes here, then it goes there, it goes there, splits there. And then there, I need to find something else that, um, you know, Basically, the you know the one on the left. I try to maybe find one so I don't have to put the 90 degree thing there. Makes it a little bit nicer. Uh, but it's a working solution. It's all water tight. I use dry steel uh, at the bottom of this to make it all nicely, um, you know, fitted and suited and everything. Um, so that's how I did the bottle. Um, just go to leave it for now. Go to test it later and see how it goes. So I found myself this one, everything mounted up, water fluid in, you can see how it sits, so it goes from there, 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 splits over there, and then goes to that one, so let me close the bonnet here. And here we go. Perfect.